Double Dragon. It's your boy Amen. It's like him. Back with some new heat for y'all today. Heard what she said. Get it, man. How y'all doing? We got some webtoons for y'all. Big facts, man. This one is called Doom Breaker. Um, we know it just came out, and um, we just put on to this, and heard that it was some heat, so we wanted to check it out, man. Yeah, I don't know what it's about. Um, definitely uh, interested to find out what it's gonna be about, and then that way it's gonna answer our question of what kind of story did that they're going to tell pretty much yeah i'm most interested in the art style uh the story and the characters like as long as they portray that like super well i think it's only four episodes out so i'm excited to see kind of like how interesting it is after like four episodes that makes sense yeah same here facts but yeah man you ready to get into it let's run it up uh, Start off with that whoosh. It's a dragon. Style is nice. Is it a stack of dragons? And they start now crazy. Rumble. Behold. Dang, is that a sword? Stab. Drip, drip. Last human? Excuse me. Is he like mixed? Yeah, like him, victory is mine. Oh, he attacking a dang sword, bro. Oh, he stabbed him. He said last human. So he must not be human. Good <laughs> The Oscar goes to. <laughs> Blaze. This dude look cold too with the sword. Sword on fire and everything. And he got impaled yeah. with a blaze sword. The world has ended. It's been a year since we lost a war with the demons. Oh, so it's humans versus demons. Most of humanity has been slaughtered. They ain't a tall freaking demon. And those who survive have become mindless hosts, only being used to give birth to monsters. Sheesh. Ugh. Spiders? Ah! Can't do the spiders. As the last survivor of the resistance army, I went on fighting alone. Until this very moment. Tartarus, the god of destruction. That just made me think of Tartarus house, I'm sorry. <laughs> and the lord of demons. Dang, he went against the top dog. Tartarus house. Don't forget the tartar sauce. <laughs> Shade, you look like you're suffering. Here, let me help you. <laughs> he on dirt. That's like that uh, Wonder Woman whip. Truth whip. I gave you a little longer to live so that we can have a little conversation. That's Shade. So human. Zephyr, was it? His name cold too. You're the first human who's been such a nuisance for, to me for so long. Your, persist, your persistence has been extraordinary, I'll give you that. Step. Step. They say that only a fool will go on fighting a losing battle. But those who give up straight away out of fear of their enemies aren't any wiser. Why you about to play rock, paper, scissors? They're just weak. So I'd like to make you an offer. Come and serve me. What would you do? I'm dying. I'm already stabbed. I ain't got time for it. Ain't nobody got time for that. We'll go behind this little world and conquer all, even the home of the gods. You and I, together. My man's look cold with the white hair and the sword. He can't die. Dun, dun. The hand coming out. Uh oh. Whew. 
Do you mean it? Of course. Well, that's why you about to fake him, bro. <laughs> that's not a bad offer. Not. My body was just completely, was completely ruined in that fight just now. He knows full well that I'll never recover. Dang. And yet he wants me to join him. He says he's giving me a second chance. This isn't an offer. He just wants to see me pathetically beg for my life. Dang. He wants to see me beg to an enemy, the one that took away my friends and everyone I ever loved from me. Dang. You better get some resolve and mock this motherfucker. Trembling? Reach. She said I was too aggressive. Okay, okay. She told me not to swear so much. But I wouldn't listen. So she cast this silly spell on me. Claps. Flinch. What spell she cast? If I do a certain something with my hand. Whoa! What's going on here? A massive burst of power from another dimension would blow me up. Oh, you about to set him up. Oosh. Here's my answer to your offer. Tyrus. Lord of demons, you biznitch. Screw you. Dang, gave him the finger. A-hole. Dang, you doing a Vegeta. And all the people to say. It's just an ability. Targeted. Foosh. You think that was enough? Mm. I don't know. Probably. Nope. Just blew his hand off? My hand. Huh? What happened to my hand? Are you son of a bee? How dare you? Humiliate me like this. You pathetic little human. Ah, dang! Slammed him! Thud. Crumble. With that, my long fight came to an end. I can see that. I failed to avenge my loved ones or save humanity like they hoped I would. The whole thing ended in a bitter defeat. Or oh, it should have, at least. Dang, what uh -huh. happened? Twitch, I died just now. Strange, my wounds have all healed. And my armor is brand new. Where am I? I see statues of the gods. Is that a, is it a temple? I've never seen a temple like this before. Well, we got some food there, something. <laughs> uh, I see, this is the afterlife. So this must be the underworld. This isn't the underworld. Uh, who's that? Oh, shoot. It's the bottom, most level of the pantheon where the gods reside. Dang, where the gods is? Shimmer, shimmer. Glow, glow. Whoa, whoa. Talk to me. That's what I'm talking about. Take the first thing, take the second. Flutter. Hell, attacker? <laughs> Freeze. My sword can't be summoned. Are oh, you trying to summon it? Don't be alarmed, Zephyr. I'm a messenger of the gods. My name is Mercedes. I'm an elite angel. You're already dead. Normally you would be sent immediately to the underworld. But at the insistence of several gods, the three supreme gods have decided to send you back in time. I wonder why. You would be sent to the past with all your memories intact as a chance for you to change how things happen. Wow, bro, this is like a once in a lifetime thing. Of course, you only keep your memories. Your physical training, mana, and other experience such as acquired skills will not be restored. Am I dreaming? I don't think Taurus can make people see things. Or am I hallucinating because I'm dying? Sigh. Why are you giving me a second chance? I know it must be hard to believe. You need some kind of proof? No. Let's just say I believe you. I just want to know. What you expect me to do? 
Nothing in the world is free. You're only giving me a second chance because you want something. Isn't that right? Those calculating bastards would never give anything for free. Very well. To answer your question, I will let the gods speak for themselves. Oh, shit. Man, she got, she got attitude. <laughs> Blink. We want to see something. A little more entertaining. The guys who had the eye on you were disappointed to see you die. It's extremely rare for a human face with certain death to put up a fight with such a strong will until the very end. The guys were very impressed that you managed to fight against a vast army of demons for five dang for five long years. Your struggle was worth watching. Dang! Just watching them? He choked. Man was just adding up his guy points. <laughs> Many guys were sad to see you being taken out of the world so soon. Remember how you seemed to get luckier as the end drew near? Wow! That was because the guys offered you their support in spite of the karmic price they had to pay. Oops. Man, he sent them away that what's going on? I feel like he's mad. What's about to oh, I'm about to slam his fist around? Dang. Oh, Kaboom. you bastards! It just told you. Was that entertaining for you? Mm. They on their gladiator mm. stuff. Seeing me, us, fight desperately to survive. It's just a bit of entertainment that was worth watching. Do you think that's why we fought? entertain you are you not entertained that's all you think we're good for oh shoot mm. <laughs> she about to mop this man flash dang oh dang that's not summon up oh what is that she was like i wasn't trying to do this to you bro the guys are watching. Show some respect. You seem to be misunderstanding, so let me correct you. You're the only one that the gods found entertaining. They've never been interested in a dull, ordinary species like humans. You have to prove that you're worth their time if you want something from them. The same goes for both the individual and the entire species. Nothing in the world is free. You're harping on that a lot. And another thing. See? There's another who strongly insisted that you be resurrected for a different reason. The freak is going on. I'm tired of waiting. I want to see your manager right now. That's the dude that killed him. Yeah, please. You can't do this, sir. Your request is currently being processed. <laughs> Shut up. I've conquered 10 worlds. It's impossible that a mere human could have hurt me. It never happened. I want to remove from the records. What? This man. Make it go away right now. I don't care how much karma I have to pay. Dang, they gotta pay in karma? Atarus is the god of destruction who has annihilated 10 worlds, including yours. His goal is to destroy, to destroy as many worlds as he can. He's never lost a fight, and he never had even been injured by anyone. He had a perfect track record. Oh, damn. Until you broke it. Oh. Do you have any idea what a massive hit to his pride that was? What? That's why he wants to bring me back? That petty son of a... He wants to fight you once more to restore his perfect score. What do you say, Zephyr? Might as well. Yeah, come <laughs> back alive. You're kidding, right? If he's so eager to die, I'll gladly kill him. Go crazy, even though he just mopped you. I don't like that it's from these nauseating gods, but an opportunity is an opportunity. 
This is my chance to get this is my chance to get revenge. Not only against Ataris, but against all those guys who treated us like worthless vermin. Look, co coordinates have been created. I'm just waiting for the final approval from the guys to interfere with space time. I wonder how they do that. Where it's like ding ding ding. Done. Carrier pigeon. Well, good luck, Zephyr. I hope you put a good show on for us. That's crazy. Hey, he's not breathing. Crap, we're in big trouble now. Remember, remember. Shut up, man. Hey, wake up. Come on. Wake up, new guy. Hey, he opened his eyes. See? I told you he wasn't dead. What the? Who are these people? They look familiar. At least you know he's back in time where like the humans are kind of. Mm -hmm. Still this, got the memories. This brand. Oh, I just remembered. <laughs> hey, he's laughing. They sent me back 10 years to when I was 20. 10 years? So he was 30 years old? This is when I used to be a slave in a temple. What's going on over there? Nothing, sir. Break time is over. Get back to work. Yes, sir. Hey, punk, if you pull any crap like that again, you're dead. Thanks, mister, for protecting me. Who's this kid? It's been 10 years, so I've already forgotten some details. My perks. Uh, what's his perks? All you have to do is say unlock perks to use them whenever you like. What? That's what she said. Let me see. Judge. judge. Unlock perks. It's gonna be three potions. <laughs> Wait, what do we have here? No way. I can't believe they gave me this. Ah, uh, okay. How you gonna tell us? So far, I think it's cool. I think we've seen the the travel back in time mm -hmm. kind of storyline a couple times. Yeah. Um. I know they did it in the beginning after the end. Uh, and the Tokyo Revengers a little bit in the anime. But um, yeah, you got a second chance. Would I go back 10 years to fix something? Yes. Um, I'll do the same motherfucking thing. Uh, but it's seemed cool. I like the art style. Yeah. I like the main character so far. I don't like how like it happened, like just entertaining the guys and they just was like, uh, you're the only one that damaged uh, Tataris, so like, you're entertaining. So I'm gonna send you back and give you another chance. But other than that, man, I think it's uh, shaping, shaping along. Two things. Yeah, it's pretty It's pretty decent. Um, I, I thought it was like coming together like an isekai anime. I think I said that right. Where like, the person dies and then they, Kind of get reborn to go do some other purpose, but they kind of put their own little spin to it. Where he came, technically, he just went to the past. Yeah, to just do it again. Uh, interesting take. You probably learn more about it, his like past and stuff like that, and um, all the people he lost, and figure out how he gonna get stronger. Yeah. Uh, this time around, where he actually beat the the tartar sauce guy. Yeah, cause I don't know. He gonna have to get way stronger. Yeah. To figure out what's going on or he can make sure everybody else you know are more prepared too so he, he don't have to fight by himself yeah so, and then i'm interested to see what, what this little perk that they gave him because that kind of dictate how they i guess might be going about this stuff yeah going going forward so you, so you can kind of get used to to like how they pretty much do this i guess yeah. but yeah man so far pretty dope you know what I'm saying? Normally we do like after the first episode or of a series, we'll kind of judge if it's going to be heat or not. But recently, it's like sometimes you got to watch things like like the first like three or four episodes before you can like really tell mm -hmm. and stuff like that. Um, so yeah. I'm excited to see how far this go. Same here, man. But yeah, man, dope episode. Hope y'all enjoyed it. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Make sure to check these videos out. Not, uh. Make sure y'all go check out Webtoon, man. It's a bunch of dope stuff on there. I'm pretty sure you'll find anything you like. They got tons of genres. Facts, man. Double dragon out. Peace. Deuces.